Hello, 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 and welcome to the latest installment of And Sarah Appeared. My name is Sarah, and I'm appearing before you today to let you know that if you've ever grown up in manipulation, you're most likely manipulating people through your codependency today. How does this happen? If you're constantly transforming yourself into or molding yourself into the opinions of what others say in order to just get your way or to get the next high or fix off of an affirmation, some people like the attention, other people like monetary gifts, other people just want a kind word being said to them. Whatever your doggy treat is, the best thing that you can do to come out of codependency is look at it from the lens that you are a manipulator. You are trying to force a situation to give you an outcome that was never supposed to produce that kind of value in your life. The only way you can get real and true value is if you receive it from knowing who God says you are and understanding that you don't have to work or perform for his love. Until you grasp that concept, and that's going to take being one with God, being alone with God, allowing Jesus Christ to be your Lord and Savior, until you grasp that, you're constantly going to be in a cycle of manipulating and toxicity.